Wow, wow, wow. I, I don't think anyone saw this one coming. I definitely haven't ran in a, to put on the dress. Uh, I mean, you know, you, you have to have, you have to have boundaries. You have to have limits that you refuse to cross. Kevin doesn't have to worry about what people are going to say about him wearing a dress because of the long line of dress wearing people before. Kevin Hart need not concern himself with the judgments and criticisms that might arise from his decision to don a dress. He is merely following a path trodden by numerous individuals who have come before him, all of whom have participated in the time-honored tradition of portraying characters in dresses for comedic effect. This trend has become a sort of rite of passage within the entertainment industry, a phenomenon that's been acknowledged and discussed by various comedians, including the venerable Dave Chappelle, who candidly shared his experiences of being pressured into roles that required him to wear dresses, all in the name of advancing his career. For quite some time, Cat Williams has been an outspoken advocate on this topic suggesting that there is an underlying element of truth behind the conspiracy theories that swirl around black male entertainers and their alleged obligation to participate in such roles in order to ascend to higher echelons of fame. Dave Chappelle's previous revelations about this issue only served to magnify its prominence, as he openly refused to capitulate to the demands of wearing a dress even if it meant turning down astronomical financial offers and forfeiting the potential for increased exposure. Kevin Hart, who has always attributed his accomplishments to his tireless work ethic, is also ensnared in this narrative. While he vehemently denies allegations of selling out and adamantly champions the concept of hard work as the bedrock of his achievements, his involvement in an SNL skit where he donned a dress became a lightning rod for controversy. This, in turn, stoked the fires of speculation and debate, with some critics accusing him of forsaking his principles for the sake of mainstream fame, while others view his choice through a more pragmatic lens, recognizing the strategic considerations that come with career advancement in the entertainment sphere. Cat Williams, on his part, has been unabashedly vocal about his apprehensions concerning Kevin Hart's career trajectory. Williams has implied that Hart may have transgressed certain ethical boundaries and made certain compromises on his journey to success, suggesting a willingness to venture into uncharted territory that others might deem off-limits. Williams has framed his critique within a broader context, asserting that maintaining artistic authenticity and adhering to personal principles should be prioritized over succumbing to external pressures and temptations in the pursuit of fame. At the heart of this ongoing feud between Cat Williams and Kevin Hart lies a complex discourse that transcends mere personal differences. It lays bare the intricate dynamics that comedians and entertainers navigate in their pursuit of recognition, influence, and financial success within an industry that often requires balancing artistic integrity with marketability. This controversy prompts introspection about the authenticity of comedic expression and the extent to which entertainers are willing to traverse the fine line between their artistic vision and the demands of commercial viability.